actually when I used to hang out with Puffy <laughs> around the pool and that, yeah. I never saw any of this going on. But I hear like, you know, some of the women saying he did this and did that. One of his exes saying that for years he abused her. Isn't it funny that they stay with him for years? Must be the money. Some of these singers that come out now, like, look at the big thing with Tay Tay. I don't get her fascination. I was going to say exactly the like, same thing. <laughs> but even when Bieber come out, I'm yeah, like, it's yeah. like, these companies, if they want you to be famous, they'll make you famous. Yeah. It's like they can use machines to make you sound decent if you're marketable. They can make a star out of you. You look like a fucking clown the way you yeah. dress, but you think it's so cool and order millions in gold and diamonds around your neck and fucking. It's like they almost think like they're above everyone. Yeah, well, I guess. Um, so you're just saying you're you're uh, you as a huge hip hop fan, your world's no, been um, it, turned no, upside no. down by one of your he heroes and, 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 and can't believe it. Can and I? the host of your favorite parties. <laughs> <laughs> exactly when i used to hang out with puffy around the pool and that, yeah. i never saw any of this going on but i hear like you know some of the women saying he did this and did that one of his exes saying that for years he abused her isn't it funny that they stay with him for years must be the money no they're nice guys yeah it's funny <laughs> yeah. That they're coming out of yeah. the woodwork now aren't yeah. they and then he settled with one out of court but it's funny what's his name that um is it cat williams that comedian guy the black guy he reckons he's got videos on diddy and all them He's been blackballed. He did some interviews saying he just never went along with the Hollywood crowd. He, he could tell you stories. and But they reckon that Diddy does it with guys as well, like Bieber and different things went on. I forget what other singers that came. Yeah, Usher, I think, too. Yeah, there's a few of them mentioned that he's done, like, stuff with guys as well. So, And they reckon that plane that went to, was it some island the other day? Yeah. That plane, because he wasn't on They reckon that plane was full of evidence that he has on people because i reckon once you get that famous and people come over and if all this sex stuff was going on he's got videos of it that's what he holds over people that's why he's never really been in, almost like a yeah epstein type yeah, thing, yeah. You know? and that's probably why maxine 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 whatever her name is is still alive because yeah just just yeah, like if she ended up dead she could be like look if i end up dead these things are ready to be sent out so He's got some insurance policy, I think, so he might end up dead. Well, Puff Daddy. But then I was watching a show the other day, too. They reckon he was behind the Tupac and... Yeah. Who was the other guy that got shot? Yeah. yeah. He was behind that sort of thing as well, so... I think there was different things they were showing about those cases at the time when he had the gun in the club and shot someone, and then one of his other people was shot, and his head of security was the same head of security for Michael Jackson, and... Yeah, oh, I, I, I mean... You just think about all the talented mm -hmm. performers that are out there that never made it. Mm -hmm. And you, like, if you're at the top of the thing... And some of these ones that are at the top, you seem like they're shit. Like some of them sound like shit. You think, how did this... Like, you always watch something like some of these singers that come out now. Like, look at the big thing with Tay-Tay. I don't get her fascination. I was going to say exactly the like, same thing. <laughs> but even when Bieber come out, I'm yeah, like, it's yeah. Like, I think these companies, if they want you to be famous, they'll make you famous. Yeah. It's like they can use machines to make you sound decent. If you're marketable, they can make a star out of you. And some people who are great singers, because they don't have the look or they don't have that it factor, like you said, they could have the best voice in the world, but you'll never fucking hear of them. And you get these people to come out to just sing like trash. You're like, how's this person so fucking popular? It's like unbelievable. I don't get it. So, yeah, yeah. this whole thing with... Tay Tay, I'm like, fuck me, dude. It's like, I don't even find her because she just seems fake. Every time I see her, the fake smile, and then, yeah, it's like, yeah. I think behind closed doors, she's probably a fucking nightmare. <laughs> I, I, That's why she has all these boyfriends that leave and she writes songs about them. So. Yeah, I just think that there's there's so much money involved, mm. and not, not the artists, but the people that control the artists. Oh, yeah. Like, they've got that much power, mm -hmm. and, and why are they going to give it to someone? Uh, based on talent, they want someone they can mm -hmm. control and they can make money off because they know they they can give mm -hmm. it to anyone. Well, I reckon there's so many. There's probably so many videos and things that have happened that because they said you know even music artists, but even famous people would go to he did his parties and stuff. So God knows what you know those type of people with that much money. You know, there's drugs and hookers and fucking god knows what's going on there so it would be a bit of monkey business for sure so, well um I'll and if you, if you could film it you had cameras in rooms hey i got someone pretty famous here <laughs> oh definitely mm. no it's um uh i don't know if you've seen it it's on uh 
it was a show called Tehran and it was about it was a um, fictitious story about um, Mossad agents in um, Tehran they're, they're trying to um, um, you know get high ranking figures mm-hmm. are going to bomb at the, the nuclear plant and, and it just showed how they use blackmail on these oh, yeah. just low level guys that worked at this power mm-hmm. plant you know this guy was into drugs uh-huh. he worked at the power plant oh come over yeah I oh, do you want a line yeah no worries and then um Oh, would you mind turning the thing off at the power plant? No, I can't. I'll get in big trouble. Oh, but I think you're going to get in big trouble for this. <laughs> exactly. And you just realise, oh, like, I'm oh, sure that shit it's such a powerful tool. Oh. Could you imagine if you had even, like, famous actors or producers or just politicians came to your party, you just had a few cameras set up and just to say they're in the kitchen and all on the table is fucking cocaine, yep. pills. you got these high-up people snorting cocaine. Maybe there's a married guy there, but he's come by himself and he's hooking up with some stripper in the corner, kissing and making out. Then you got it all on film. I said, you'd have tons of material where you'd have people in your pocket for, <laughs> forever. No, and look, it's more, uh, they reckon with today's society, it's not that a big deal if you get done with drugs or, mm-hmm. or um, it's hookers. It's the underage shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's the one, you know. But you that, told me she was 18. Yeah, yeah, well, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, she looked 18. Yeah, She's only yeah, 15. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's that's the one they. Mm-hmm. Um, Here's her license. Yeah. Her, here's her ID. She's still going to school, so we need you to, you know. Or um, I or need in, a couple of million and this sort of thing. You or, know that property you got in Florida? Yeah, I want that. <laughs> or in um, P Diddy's case, obviously he's using gay sex. Mm-hmm. So you know that's not going to be that, that's not going to help a uh, a, a rap mm-hmm. a rap Beaver, artist. What, Beaver, why are you giving forty percent of your money to P Diddy for? Well, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you got a few videos on yeah. me. <laughs> you told me it was a microphone I was singing into, yeah, but yeah. Uh, I was a bit fucked up. Yeah. Yeah, it's like I said, I think too, when people get into those positions, some are, like I said, I've known a lot of rich people who are just down to earth, but I think some love that position of power, you know, with their ego. Get, you yeah. know, you know, when they go to award shows and the clothes they wear, you're like, you look like a fucking clown the way you dress, yeah. but you think it's so cool and all the millions in gold and diamonds around your neck and fucking, it's like, they almost think like they're above everyone. They get this like, I am such and such and they have all these people to just wait on them hand and foot and like i said even with michael jackson you get people i watched that whitney houston documentary where even doctors just prescribe them anything they want yeah even what the drugs they want yeah. so it's just i'm sure they probably don't even have to pay for drugs you know you'd have a drug dealer be like oh i'll bring you tons of coke and pills just to come to the party and hang out and get yeah. to meet everyone yeah. so they've got an abundance of everything and i think when they have that they just think they're above everything, you know? And then they, if they get away with something, you know, if you say you're speeding all the time, a cop pulls you over, ah, oh, I say, you did it, okay, you're right. You just feel untouchable yeah. all the time, so. No, I think They it... probably get away with more shit and more shit, or, oh, we had a complaint about this girl and that, oh, it's you, is it? Okay, okay, well, we'll take care of it. Don't worry, we'll go and sort it out for you. So you're not going to press charges? No, no, you're right. And then you become friends with that cop and he's probably coming yeah. over all the time and give it a heads up they're coming for a raid <laughs> yeah no i just reckon that so say with the using the diddy example uh you're an up-and-coming artist and you know they're, they're obviously making their choice mm-hmm. but the people that control it um they know once you find out the whole system's rigged mm-hmm. you can't go around saying um oh yeah look you know you get chosen it's not based on talent it's no. who's who's gets chosen he did me in the ass yeah, I yeah. The top so so going, like what's that what's the what ultimate, did you do to get to the top <laughs> what's the ultimate way uh-huh. of um, like the, saying, whole, the whole harvey weinstein thing remember saying someone's going to play along with the game I know, it's, like, it's like harvey <laughs> weinstein it's like what he did wasn't right but you know if i bring you into my office and i say listen you want the lead role that's worth 10 million but to get it, you got to fuck me. If you fuck me, then it's a business deal. Yeah, I know, I Even know. Even though what I'm asking is wrong, but if you agree to it, hey, you can't come yeah, back know, and say, oh, he raped me. It's yeah. like, no, you agreed to it. You wanted to be fucking famous and be this famous movie yeah. star. So you took the offer, you got paid. Now you've won an Oscar, your career's set. So don't come back years later saying, oh, he raped me and I had to do this. No, you had a choice. You could have walked out and said yeah. no. Somebody else would have got yeah. the role, so... 
Yeah, but, you know, it's not right what they do, but a lot of people do that all the time. No, well, that's the... Um, the like old saying, you, to get ahead, you got to give it. No, so. but just that, that the person in that example, like, they've got the power to stop oh, yeah. this guy. If everyone went in and said, no, no, no. Look how okay, many actors who have been blackboard in Hollywood who just don't go with the yeah. flow. They go, oh, you'll never make a movie again. This person's difficult. They tell their friends, don't hire this one because... He's not on the team. He won't play along with what we're doing. So yeah, you're yeah. out. 